Hello everyone, welcome to Audit Academy. In this video, we'll solve 12 marks problem on subsidiary books. Question number 3. Enter the following transactions in relevant subsidiary books of Kavya. So here certain transactions they have given for the year 2021 December month. Transactions we have to record in respective subsidiary books. That is purchase book, purchase written book, sales book, sales written book, cash book and journal proper. So let's start with the first transaction. December 2000, December 1st, 2021. Purchased goods from frame for rupees 20,000 less 5% trade discount. So on 1st December, so this Kavya has purchased 20,000 rupees goods from Prey at 5% trade discount. So this is the credit purchase and this entry will appear in purchases book. Let's start the, let's prepare the purchases book. Solution, write the heading purchases. Books, columns are date, invoice number, name of the supplier, LF, amount. So whatever the purchase transactions are there in this problem, we'll take first in this purchases book. So on 1st December, purchase goods from frame for rupees 20,000. So write the date 2021 December 1st. So in the name of the Name of the supplier is Mr. Prem. So we have bought goods from Prem worth of rupees 20,000. So write in bracket 20,000. And this Prem has allowed 5% trade discount. So Prem in Madidane 5% trade discount and a Kotidane. So minus 5% trade discount. 20,000 minus 5% trade discount. The final amount is 19,000. So Kavya has to pay rupees 90,000 to frame after deducting the 5% trade discount on the goods purchases. So first transaction I took. So this problem is really purchases. I enter in the now purchase book. So on December 3rd, Purchase goods from Suni for rupees 15,000 for cash. So, 3rd December, goods and a purchase from Suni for cash. So, cash transaction is So, cash transaction is there. And then now, purchases book. Purchases book only credit purchases transactions and a stay record. So 3rd January, 3rd December, goods and purchase now from Sunil for cash. Cash and a cut to goods and a karadi maadidevi. So this entry will appear in cash book and not in purchases book. So we'll see later. 5th December is sales. Then 8th December is also sales. Now see the December 10th entry. See the December 10th. On December 10th, purchased goods from Mohan for rupees 15,000 less trade discount 10%. 10th December, you know, goods and a karedi from Mohan from Mohan for rupees 15,000. So write in solution date December 10th, goods are purchased from Mr. Mohan. Okay. Worth of goods is 15,000. So goods in a value is to 15,000. And this Mohan has given 10% trade discount minus 10% trade discount. So 15,000 minus 10% trade discount. Final amount is 13,500. 13th goods and a sale madi dewe, 17th goods and a return madi dewe, 20th goods and return madi dewe, 22nd sold, 
and on 25th December. 25th December, purchase goods from Naveen for rupees 20,000. So, December 25th, ge, goods and a karedi maadi dewe from Naveen. So, purchases book alibari de date, December 25th, goods are purchased from Mr. Naveen. Name of the supplier is Naveen. So, yes, rupees and a goods and a karedi maadi dewe 20,000. So, direct tag amount and amount column are 20,000. No discount allowed. Next on December 30th. December 30th bought goods from Ajay rupees 6,500. So, 30th December ye goods and a karedi maadi dewe from Ajay. Writing date column December 30th. Name of the supplier, Mr. Ajay, and the value of goods is 6500. So, this problem is the purchase, purchase of goods on credit basis. I will entry in now purchases book record. So, here purchases book entry transactions are completed. Now, add the amount column 19,000. Plus 13,500 plus 20,000 plus 6,500. Total is 59,000. So, on December 31st, credit purchases of Kavya is 59,000. Okay. Purchases book I too. Next, we will prepare purchase return book. So, we will Transaction LLLE purchase return is there. I enter in now purchases return book. Ali to follow now. Purchase return book columns date, debit note number, name of the supplier, LF, AMA. So LLLE purchase return is there. The line entry and now purchase return book only topple bit. So there is on December 20th. Okay, December 20th goods return to frame rupees 5000. So December 1st a transaction note. December 1st again I mean Madhvi goods purchased from frame for rupees 20,000 less 5 percent trade discount. First December again 20,000 rupees in a goods and now Kharidi Madhvi from so on 20th December in Avid Madi Dewe 5000 rupees in a goods and now Prem Ge Vapas Madi Dewe due to certain reason. So this entry will appear in purchase return book. So right here date 2021 December 20th goods are returned to Prem. Okay and the amount is 5000. Really debit note number, invoice number, you know, code la. So, leave that. Next, on December 28th, returned goods worth rupees 3000 to Mohan. Okay. See here, December 10, nige. December 10, see in the problem. December 10, nige, purchased goods from Mohan for rupees 15,000. Let's trade, let's trade discount 10%. December 10th, ye, Kavya in Madidlu, 15,000 rupees in a goods and a Kharidi Madidlu. So, December 10th, ye, Kavya has purchased 15,000 rupees goods from Mohan. And on 28th, December, ye, 3,000 rupees in a goods and a Mohan, ye, Vapas Madidlu. That is the purchase return. So, this entry will record in purchase return book. December 28th, goods are returned to Mr. Mohan and the value of goods is rupees 3000. So, December 30th, ke be, goods bought goods from Ajay rupees 6500. And on December 31st, again, Madhidare. Allowance claimed from Ajay for shortage of 
for shortage rupees 50 take this one will take in purchase written book december 31st name of the supplier ajay and amount is 50 so total amount is 5000 plus 3000 plus 50 total 8050 purchase return total is 8050 next we'll prepare sales book sales book of kavya date invoice number name of the customer lf amount read the problem december 5th sold goods to suresh for rupees 12000 5th december ge 12000 rupees ina goods ana sell madideve to suresh right in date 2021 december 5th name of the customer is mr suresh and the value of goods is rupees 12000 Next on December 8, sold goods to Kavana, rupees 50, rupees 35,000, less trade discount, 10%. 8th December, 50, 35,000 rupees in a goods and a sell made deve to Kavana at 10% trade discount. Write in solution, date December 8, name of the customer is Kavana. So, S rupees in a goods and a career, S rupees in a goods and a sell money they were 35,000. Other 10% trade discount and all of money they So, minus 10% trade discount 35,000 minus 10% trade discount. The final amount is 31,500. Okay, we will calculate my body. Discount 35,000 into 10 percent. So, I started 3,500. So, 3,500 is the trade discount amount. So, total purchase amount is today 35,000. Adrinda discount amount and a minus money 35,000. 35,000 minus 3,500. So the final amount is 31,500. Okay, this is the final amount. So the long procedure, I get a direct tag in you 35,000 minus 10% calculator. The limited model, calculator, the limited direct answer. That is 31,500. Next on December 13th. Sold goods to Sundar for rupees 30,000. Right in solution, December 30, sold goods to Mr. Sundar and the amount of goods is 30,000. Next on last, December 31st, sold goods to Bimal rupees 2,000. December 31st, name of the customer is Mr. Bimal and the value of goods is rupees 2000. So all the sales entries are completed here. Add the amount column 12,000 plus 31,500 plus 30,000 plus 2000. Total is 75,500. So at the end of the month, the total Credit sales of Kavya is seventy-five thousand five hundred. Next is sales written book date, credit note number, name of the sub, name of the customer, LF amount. So on December seventeenth, goods returned by Sundar worth rupees. 500. See here, December 13th sold goods to Sundar for rupees 30,000. December 13th, yeah, we have sold 
ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ಟು ಸುಂದರ್ ವರ್ತ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ತರ್ಟಿ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ತರ್ಟೀನ್ತಿಗೆ ಸೇಲ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೇವೆ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ತಿಗೆ ಏನಾಗಿದೆ ಸುಂದರ್ ಹ್ಯಾಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ವರ್ತ್ ಆಫ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ವಿಲ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಬುಕ್ ಸೊ ರೈಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟೀನ್ ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಮಿಸ್ಟರ್ ಸುಂದರ್ ನೇಮ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಕಸ್ಟಮರ್ ಇಸ್ ಸುಂದರ್ ಸೊ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಫೈವ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸಿಂಗಲ್ ಇಂಟ್ರೆಸ್ಟ್ ಇದೆ ಒಂದೇ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ರಿಟರ್ನ್ ಇದೆ ಸೊ ಡೈರೆಕ್ಟ್ ಆಗಿ ಟೋಟಲ್ ಮಾಡ್ರಿ ಫೈವ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಸಿ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ನಾವು ಎಲ್ಲಿ ತಗೊಳ್ಳಿಲ್ಲ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಬುಕ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ತಗೊಳ್ಳಿಲ್ಲ ಯಾಕಂದ್ರೆ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಗೆ ಏನಾಗಿದೆ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಸುನೀಲ್ ಫಾರ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಫಾರ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಸೊ ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ನಾವು ಖರೀದಿ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೇವೆ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಸುನೀಲ್ ಬೈ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಫಾರ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಅಂತ ಮೆನ್ಷನ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದಾರೆ ಸೊ ಇಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸಾಕ್ಷನ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಟ್ರಾನ್ಸಾಕ್ಷನ್ ವಿಲ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಬುಕ್ ಅಂಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇನ್ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಬುಕ್ ಸೊ ಐ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ಡ್ ಯುವರ್ ಕ್ಯಾಶ್ ಬುಕ್ ಪರ್ಚೇಸಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ನಾವು ಎಲ್ಲಿ ತಗೊಳ್ತೇವೆ ಪೇಮೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಅಲ್ಲಿ ಸೊ ರೈಟ್ ಇಯರ್ ಟೂ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಒನ್ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಥರ್ಡ್ ಪರ್ಚೇಸಸ್ ಸೊ ಎಷ್ಟು ರುಪೀಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಗೂಡ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ನ ಪರ್ಚೇಸ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೇವೆ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಸುಮಿ ಫ್ರಾಮ್ ಸುನೀಲ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ತೌಸಂಡ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಕ್ಲೋಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಆನ್ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಸೋಲ್ಡ್ ಓಲ್ಡ್ ನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಟು ಥಾಮಸ್ ರುಪೀಸ್ ಟೂ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸೊ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಗೆ ಓಲ್ಡ್ ನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಅನ್ನ ಸೇಲ್ ಮಾಡಿದ್ದೇವೆ ಟು ಥಾಮಸ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ವಿಲ್ ಅಪಿಯರ್ ಇನ್ ಜರ್ನಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇನ್ ಸೇಲ್ಸ್ ಬುಕ್ ಸೊ ಹಿಯರ್ ಪ್ರಿಪೇರ್ ಜರ್ನಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಪರ್ ರೈಟ್ ಇನ್ ಡೇಟ್ ಕಾಲಮ್ ಡಿಸೆಂಬರ್ ಟ್ವೆಂಟಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಎಂಟ್ರಿ ಈಸ್ ಥಾಮಸ್ ಅಕೌಂಟ್ ಡೆಬಿಟೆಡ್ ಟು ಸೇಲ್ ಆಫ್ ಓಲ್ಡ್ ನ್ಯೂಸ್ ಪೇಪರ್ ಅಂಡ್ ದ ಅಮೌಂಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಟೂ ಹಂಡ್ರೆಡ್ ಸೊ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಆನ್ ಸಬ್ಸಿಡಿಯರಿ ಬುಕ್ಸ್ ಟ್ವೆಲ್ ಮಾರ್ಕ್ಸ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಐ ಹೋಪ್ ಯು ಲೈಕ್ ದಿ ವಿಡಿಯೋ ಪ್ಲೀಸ್ ಸಬ್ಸ್ಕ್ರೈಬ್ ಮೈ ಚಾನಲ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಶೇರ್ ವಿತ್ ಯುವರ್ ಫ್